Hello everybody, Smith here. Welcome back to some more Stellaris. We are playing as the sickeningly nice Chim Coalition on our mission to make friends around the galaxy, which is proving to be easier said than done. Um, on the plus side, we have just guessed liberated rather a large uh, a large swathe of uh swathe of space from some of our more immediate rivals here and uh our two allies not doing so well and drawing us into more wars than we'd kind of like to be on the end of you are in a federation you don't like me much although that might change you are fanatic authoritarian these guys here i keep sort of seeing these guys and thinking Mm, you might make a nice little, um, might make a nice little, uh, little alliance there. Form a defensive pact. You are authoritarian, you are militarist. Why do they like me so much? Trust. So xenoph xenophilia, xenophile diplomacy, egalitarian rabble. Federation, we are minus 80. Hegemonic imperialists. I mean, I can invite these guys to a federation. These guys, on the other hand, yeah. Again, the hegemonic imperialists, they... Mm. I don't know. I just don't know how we are going to sort of work our way out of this. There aren't many empires that are ideal for me to ally with, which is kind of a pain in the backside for this sort of playthrough. <laughs> Ah, uh, I don't know. I just do not know. Hmm. Anyway, something for us to mull over. I might, because uh, we're not going to be using a lot of that influence. So I might form that defensive pact. Cost 2.5. I mean, would it be worth... Okay, good stuff. What I didn't take a look at is, no, they're not not rivals with any, anybody, just sitting back there minding their own business. Research complete. We could use all the friends we can get. Right, what well, I did, defense grid supercomputer. Defense platforms, oh, that'd be nice. Gonna avoid the red stuff, let's go for the purple. Minus one on the exotic gases, yeah, that's gonna uh that's gonna happen. How is our little bit of terraforming going on here? Sixteen twenty days, okay. Nothing else I really complete. desperately want to terraform. In the meantime, Yabar Prime has finished its construction crew. Construction crew? Construction queue. There we go. Got that out. Do you guys need upgrading at all? No, you're all fine. Um, what do we have? 152. So 128. That means each section of my fleet is going to be 32, so adding that on, it's going to make it 160. Don't quite have it. Construction. You, I, yeah, we'll get. Research complete. That's interesting. There we go. Oh, sorry, I was looking at... That was physics, wasn't it? I was looking for this little research boost. No wonder I couldn't find it. It's... it's 
in completely the wrong subject. Um, right, okay. Such so your assisting research. Have you finished building all those? Not quite. We can still get a little bit there. But apart from that, I don't think there's anything more for you to do. You can fall back to our Gethry Maelstrom base. Zarim, why did we build a base there? Was that two? No, that's, a, that's one of our colonies. Little odds and sods of um, of trade we can pick up here and there. Nothing huge though. I think we've um, we've got most of it. Living metal. Let's start picking up some of that. Yeah, as I said, little bits and pieces here and there, but nothing huge. Declared Assembly of Lilarobius Holdings. Oh! Now you do have an enemy. The Rish Rishethi, you... You quite like us. I mean, you're egalitarian and xenophile. And you're allied with these guys. You're... Apart from being xenophobes... Their claims on us, allied to rivals, that's the main thing. So let's work this out. If we were no longer allied to their rivals... Oh, that includes the Quiptilium Sovereignty. That would take that under 315 if we ended our rivalry... 200... That's No, they are rivals with us. But if we manage to get rid of that down to... 250 their claims on us that's down to 100 yeah because these guys are quite friendly with them and almost quite like them hmm Yeah, your friends don't like us. So it looks like these guys might be coming on board a bit more. Yeah, they're forming pacts. Still can't invite to Federation, although minus 66, that's a lot better than it was. Almost getting to the point where we could... Um, just switch our war philosophy, which... Would have consequences, but um, wouldn't be too Colony bad. Established. Oh, thank God for that. And just as that happened, you need more jobs. Let's get some power going. Alloy nano plants. Civilian. So that's kind of the next step of that. Flag artillery. Some of these would be good. Impulse thrusters. We'll get that. That sort of complements what else we've been building. Any of our other colonies need some attention. Not at the moment. So we've got you. You are going to be okay for the moment. No available jobs. We can uh, we can just uh, work with that at the moment though. Uh, 18, 15, 17. So you're the largest. Probably be an urban world. Power world. Wouldn't go much amiss. Um, energy credits from jobs, physics research, max generator district. So, sort of the agriculture is the big block there, but complete. also a bit of power. Choha, though, is a generator world. Hmm. We'll have to see. We will have to see.
Right. Fair construction enough, complete. Finish construction. Construction complete. We are chock a block with minerals. Let's go sell some more of those. Uh, so that's uh, what can we buy for about roughly the same amount? 250 alloys. Doesn't get you a lot, does it? But we can. Madam, we built. I'm trying to get them all to roughly the Incoming same transmission. level. Oh. So they're trying to be friendly with us. But we can't quite. They've just got so many of these other. really don't like me. Uh, oh my. Wow. Okay. So you'd have been so good to pick up as an ally. I think they might have changed their ethics as we've been, uh, as we've been playing through the game. They would have been so good. Ah, sadly not though. Sadly not. We'll make do with what we have. Hmm. Full of minerals again. Okay, we'll just go buy some more alloys with that. What was I doing? Yeah, we wanted to get all these three. Yeah, you are you are much further than that. Okay, you're looking pretty good. The other two were Magum and Moscot. So let's get you a couple more of those. Apart from that, yeah. I managed to get them all up to roughly the same level, so it's just a question of where do we uh, where do we focus the rest of our defenses for now? That and they got two point five base in there. Hmm. We will have to see. System contains a gateway. We're not going to reactivate this until we've got this. That base looking a little bit more powerful. So yeah, it's just a case of trying to trying to build everything up, trying to build the production back up, try and get alloys. Alloys have slipped down. I presume, yeah, that's uh, we've been got a fair bit uh, being consumed with maintenance. Exotic gases. Everything else is going up. It's just the exotic gases. Are going down. We could just set up a little bit of a trade. Mm, it's alright for the moment, actually. Is that right? We've got 164 months. Minus 1.59. So about 100 months. That's going to get. That's going to shoot by. We are already selling. Let's sell a bunch more of that. I think we're going to need to do Research some complete. More. 75. Research complete. Okay. Mega cannon. Oh, I do like I do like mega cannons. Uh, is there anything else? We're not really at the stage where we're going to get the Citadel. Hmm. Habitat. Oh, we've still got plenty of planets we can colonize. <laughs> um. Synthetic crystal plants. We're not hurting for crystals. We're well, missiles.
Well, I mean, we'll, we will be using the Citadel at some point. I can guarantee that that will be used. So we'll grab some of that. You are missing... Construction complete. Yeah. We could upgrade you. Oh, we just wait and get more consumer goods production there. I think for the moment... I'm just trying to even off. Yeah. Do that. Dram. Mining world. We can upgrade all of you. Oh, it's going to be some more gas. I don't think we need to do that at the moment. Yeah, I think we'll have to do that. I'll have to see about getting some of our other production up now here. Ah, we can start upgrading more of these. I think we'll start to build Aftershan. Where are you? You're one of our ones that are fairly close in, so... Trade value would be good. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Yabar Prime. I'm going to replace you with a civilian industry. And what was it? Civilian industry alloy foundries. Available jobs. Okay. Do that fairly early on when it won't screw with our job situation too much. And yeah. All looking good. Getting a small amount of the gases now. Ah, they, what's their fleet? 11,000. So either of our two main fleets could take them quite easily. Um, okay. We are full of influence. Let's make some claims. We can't make any claims. Huh. Right, so we have to wait for war and... Uh, policies! No, it's edicts. Let's get some peace festivals going. As we're preparing for war. Not a war, not a war we're going to start, mind you. Construction complete. We're nice people. We're not pacifist people. Well, not completely pacifist people. Uh, okay, you finished that. Uh, have you done all of that? Research You've complete. That. So, living metals coming in. Defense grid, supercomputer. What else can we get? Tachyon Lance. I mean, we could step, go down that path now. Advanced reactor booster, planetary shield generator. Not really going to use that. Let's take a look at the old Tachyon Lance. Construction complete. After Shan Prime. Okay. Okay. Yes, what was I doing? Just making sure everybody is up to the same basic standard. Let's start building. 
Construction complete. A few more of these defensive platforms. Muscots. Garden. Actually, come to think of it, I think Marden might be sort of the higher priority one here. Because we just want to stop attacks coming in there like we want to stop attacks coming in through Jaltham, and then we will have our own ships sort of coming in through here. We'll need to build up this starbase eventually, especially if we have the gateway. Drawing from Yubar Prime. That is extremely handy for us at the moment, so... Get rid of a bit more of those. Ah, oh, and we've um, consumer goods production has stabilised. Dora Prime. Research complete. Ah, oh. construction complete. Well, that's nice. What happened there? No, I want to click on that. Um, Paradise Dome. Housing and amenities. I don't think we're going to be using that. Let's get Cyto Revitalization Center. And we're losing gases again. We're losing quite a lot of money. I think it's just. Mm. Our colonies require a bit more attention. Um, great food processing centers. Our food's looking pretty good. We might just get an extra district of that. You had the Petherium plants. Apart from that, I think you're going to be pretty, pretty urban world. Could get a bit more power production going, it can't hurt. That is my dongle, which is playing up now and then, so I'm just going to unplug that. There we go. Uh, so we could upgrade these, we do have the stuff to do it. Ruler unemployment, Favarian. Worker unemployment. Lots of worker unemployment. Okay, yeah, we need to... Uh, commercial zones, commercial zones. Let's... Upgrade the two new ones we've built. That should hopefully deal with that. Consumer goods... Yeah, we've got plenty to be getting on with, and for the time being, construction complete. Magnum Starbase. Construction complete. Construction complete. Right. <laughs> And you've declared you your rival, which means that's going to... Because we're now allied to some of your rivals. How many rivalries do you have going? Oh, you are a complete. walking diplomatic disaster there. Are you this brand... Are you one of these brand new kind of breakaway republic? You are. Yeah, you uh... Construction complete. <sighs> Your future prospects at this stage of the game are not looking too rosy. Okay. 
Okay. I'm not sure there's much else we can do at the moment. Maybe, as I said, a bit of expansion. Oh, you are... You are not far away. Yeah, we are... We will, uh... We'll chuck a colony ship in your direction as soon as we can. What's the date? 2376. When did I set the uh, when did I set the end game to begin? I think it was something like Research complete. It was earlier than usual, I think. Site revitalization center, habitability modification. Don't really need to do either of those. Seventy-seven thousand. Uh, I mean, you might be of use at some point. Let's grab you. You have been... Okay, let's go grab... Send a colony ship over there. Species... Yeah, these, um... These Tillinesi... Where are they? Showing Empire species, yeah, nothing to uh, nothing to uplift. I do enjoy a good uplifting. It does add a bit of flavour to your game. Uh, Ten thousand, we should be able to just yeah, we can just steamroll you. So yeah, as I said, Mardom, I think we'll want to get you up to your full um, your full complement of defensive platforms, then we'll upgrade you to a star hold. Lacking 192. Shouldn't be long. Muscot, you need some attention. Got a little bit of stuff here. I think we will. Ah, it's the power we need mostly. Yeah. What can we do with that? Living metal mega construction. So that's all we can do in the terms of the uh, edicts there. Mega structure build speed plus fifty percent. Hmm. Mega chromia, you could also do complete. mega forges and that stuff. Right. Okay, that's suddenly yeah, we've built the uh we've built the consumer goods factories and the alloys production over on your bar, which still has unemployment issues. Right, I've got to kinda of work out what I'm doing here. Uh, Site revitalization centre. Oh, that's gonna cost gases. we build another set of those, just start to urbanise this planet a bit more. Yibar Prime! Gene Clinics. Available jobs too, it's just the rule is taking time to downgrade. Okay. We won't worry about that for the moment then. Construction complete. Muscot Prime. It's you over there, isn't it? Okay. 
Prime. So once we've done that with you, we'll upgrade you. Because if a war kicked off now, we'd have to send one of our complete. fleets off to here just to help hold mm -hmm. that, and the other one would come down here. But at least now we've actually kind of got them penned in. Which means we've got a pretty big advantage, although, yeah, I mean, one of our fleets would probably be able to take on their fleet, but... Research complete. It's kind of even a little bit tricky. Uh, Citadel! I'm not going to use you straight away. Kinetic battery. Neutronium, neutronium armor. Oh, that would be good. Let's get that. Fenhabanis Prime. We've got alloys. Let's get... Civilian Industries. Just starting to urbanize a little bit. Actually, do we want to go for the power? I mean, our production's good, but it's not that robust. I think I'm going to grab that and then just continue. I right, build speed. Uh, yeah. And then just start building up there a little bit. What's the other one we had? Magam Prime. Oh, there we go. Auspicious Alliance, Nuts and War. Oh, for goodness sake. Now we should see which empire is stronger. We're not at war. We can't really do that. So it's just the three of us again. Hmm. Preferred it if we'd had a little bit longer to uh, set everything up, but never mind. I'll just have to leave you upgrading for the moment, and that is kind of all the time we have. So we will have to leave it there. War is upon us once again. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I'm sure we can. Uh, we sure we can liberate a few more territories. Can we actually get claims? We can now start to claim some of this. 112. 112. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll be claiming that, I think, because we're nicely set up to to uh, do the uh, do the Lillerobians some serious damage here. Let's get our armies moving up there. But as I said, that's pretty much all the time we have, so we will have to leave it there. That will have to be for another day. Yeah, look forward to that. Anyway, thanks for watching, take care, and I'll see you next time.